Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Praveen Kumar Bhumil said. In this video, we'll, we'll see one of the snowflake intro question that is, does metalized view have storage? This question is asking regularly. See, question is that what does metalized view has storage? We'll confirm. Okay, okay let me create one database for understanding purpose. Create database. Okay, something like dev1 db. It's a development database. Same thing, create one schema for understanding purpose. I'm starting from first schema, SC schema. So database dev one db SC schema. Now I'm trying to create one table. So create table, EM simple table. I'm trying to get ID number. Okay. Okay, one. Okay. Now inserting few records. Insert into EMPT values one, two, and three. Okay, three records and insert. Okay. In Snowflake, DMLs are auto committable. Okay, see, select a star from EMPT. Now, how many records are there in my table? There are three records. Are there. Now, I'll try to create two views. Okay, one is so syntax is create view, view name. Okay, EMPT. Okay, EMPB as select star from EMP. Okay, so this is EMPT. It's a, I'm trying to create one normal view, same thing, copy same value, go back here, let me create one metalized view. So we should put metalized view. Okay, so how to see list of views, we can go for show views. Okay, show views, there are two types, two views are created, EMP, MV and EMP. Okay, now question is that what, now I want to say, okay, see I want to prove like, or I want to say, like does metalized views have storage? How can you check? We can able to check in the select stars from information schema. Okay, information schema dot table storage metrics. Okay, see so storage metrics. So limit. Then now see we should pass the table. Okay, so this is my view. We can able to check the storage. Now copy the same value. Now I should pass the table name. Okay, see here what are the table names we are having? So where where table name okay see i'm passing this two views what is the two views one is okay emp e and emp yeah okay copy the value emp v and same thing one more thing copy the other okay there are two views are there okay see okay one is v another one is emp okay, one is normal view other is metal as you now see what happened so okay we are passing normal view and very okay and metal as you but what happens, see, we're having entry for only metalized view. Metalized view, in the sense, so when you have entry in the sense like what? So metalized views, okay, occupies storage. This was the conclusion, occupies storage. Okay, how can you put in the sense like what? When you have, you see, I have passed normal view and metalized view. But what happened, okay, there is entry only for metalized view. So here, active bytes. Okay, see, here, nothing but what? So see, metalized view will have, Occupy storage under normal use doesn't have any storage. One one more thing. So this is one way, and another way is that what we can able to go for show metalized views. Okay, we can able to check this here. So here we are having a rows and bytes in the sense like it's a it occupy storage. Okay, see only metalized view will occupy storage. Normal use doesn't occupy. So metalized is nothing but say pre-computed result is set okay result is set so the result already computed and already stored in a separate storage nothing but it says storage okay so conclusion so by using table storage metrics and show metal issues we can able to say metal issues occupy storage okay if you like the content subscribe and share the channel thank you for watching